there. I think you can also go advertiser list here and use that search as well. Okay, wedding addresses. Let's see what happens here. All right, same same results. So we can click in here and we can view products. And a lot of the times too, uh, narrow your search down. I see. Okay, let's narrow search down for so wedding dresses. See what happens here. They have over a thousand products. This particular uh, uh, advertiser. As you can see, Commission Junction is taking a little bit longer than usual today. Here we go. So we have over a thousand products to go through in and promote directly. And you get your affiliate links from here. You can see here that we don't have any status with this particular advertiser. A lot of the times you need to like apply for there to be accepted to promote their particular links. And uh, to do that, I've got to remember how. So we just click here. Oh, yeah. And in here, I think you can apply join program. Uh, I've already been approved, <laughs> just like that. I'm approved. Now I can get HTML for this link. And uh, usually when I get a particular link to promote, then well, you can use these um, uh, kind of like these image banner images stuff if you'd like to as well. But you can find your link right in here. It's right here. It's kind of ugly and long. That would be your link. And one way to utilize this link is you can go to sites like tinyurl.com. Put it in here. Make tiny link. And this would be your affiliate link. And you promote this using the methods we're going to show you later on. And um, when people go, they'll go through to House of Brides for that exact product that we were just looking at. Which was that dress, I guess. Let's see here. That's a little confusing, to be honest. I don't know if I like this site. But it gives you an idea. You'd obviously have to go look around a little bit more. I just want to show you how it works. Another very popular um, network is called Share, Share a Sale. I've just logged in here. And then here you can uh, find merchants. Similar way, you got little search engines in here. Uh, view and search merchants. So all I did, I, ju I just clicked here, uh, view and search merchant list, and then go down here, and you could look at the different type of uh, programs you're looking into. Let's say we just go all programs here. And then we could uh, narrow down our search. See if they got anything to do with wedding dresses in here. And we got a few matches. Bridal online store. That's probably the only one we're going to be looking at. We can join the program here and get 10% commission. So that's another place. And the final place I want to show you is my favorite, clickbank.com. Clickbank.com is different than the other ones we're just looking at. Clickbank.com deals only with digital products. And a digital product would be an ebook, a video, um, maybe an audio file, stuff like that. It's all digital download sort of affiliate network and it's free. Oh yeah, I don't know if I mentioned this. It's free to sign up for all these so it doesn't cost you a single cent to join an affiliate network. And so uh, let's go take a look at ClickBank and see how we can utilize ClickBank to make money with this particular niche we uncovered. So I've just gone over to ClickBank.com and if you don't have a, an, a, an account here, all you have to do is just go to uh, sign up at the top there. And then you fill in the information, and of course, make sure you get your real, put in your your uh, information properly here because ClickBank has to send you uh, your affiliate checks. So if you don't put the right address in there, well, you're not going to get paid. And um, put in your first last name, put your email address, and uh, ClickBank will send you this like newsletter if you want. You can click this thing here if you want to get the ClickBank newsletter. It's pretty cool. I like some of the stuff that gets in the newsletter. It gives you some ideas on how to promote stuff and make money with their system, anyhow. And then you want to put in your phone number, 
ClickBank has never phoned me. I've used, I have, I think, six or seven ClickBank accounts and used them for nearly 10 years, and I have never got a phone call from ClickBank. So you can put a fake one in there if you want. It doesn't really matter. They're not going to phone you. And then you want to make a nickname, and this can be anything you want. It has to be between five and 10 letters, anything you want. Your dog's name, your last name, uh, just a number. It doesn't matter. Make it up. It's just your ID that identifies you, and you use your ID to create your affiliate links for any product that's contained in the entire ClickBank marketplace, which is tens of thousands. So once you do that, sign up, and you need that little ID. This is the most important part here is you need your ID. And um, 